What's up guys? Welcome to the course. I'm more than happy that you decided to enroll in this process simulation course. So as the name implies, Aspen Plus Getting Started course is a course prepared for those that haven't been working that much with Aspen Plus or that are not that familiarized with Aspen Plus. So if you have been working already with it, you have been doing your simulations, this course might not be a good fit for you. So I will recommend you to either check out the basic course, intermediate course, or more advanced courses. But if you haven't been working with Aspen Plus, you have no idea what's Aspen Plus, or maybe you have it in college or you have it at work and you don't know that much about it and you want to learn more about it, this is the course for you. So the name implies getting started is from zero to learning how to set up a simulation. So let me tell you a little bit of what we're going to see through all the course. So first, we're going to make a very small introduction on what's Aspen, why do we use it to uh, simulate processes, and why is it convenient for us process engineers. Then we go to the physical property environment, which, as the name implies, it's about all the physical properties that are going to be modeled in our simulation. And that's the first environment, or let's say the first step of our simulation. In this case, we need at least two things. Number one, to set up a component list, which is essentially the list of all the components that are going to be used through all the simulation. And number two, a set of rules, which we call them property methods. They calculate all the data regarding the pure substances, the mixture of substances, their interactions, and so on. Once that we set up the, the physical property environment, we go through the simulation environment. The simulation environment is a little bit more interesting because it's where we're going to spend more of the time. So here we're going to be doing uh, the flow sheet, how to manipulate it, how to add streams, what type of streams do we have, material, energy streams, and so on. Then we're going to be adding unit operations, which in Aspen Plus we call them blocks. Not only that, we're going to learn how to connect them, learn how to set up the data, because the more unit operations you can or you know how to simulate, the more real life processes we will be able to do. All this is going to be done by, let's say, working through this unique case scenario. We're going to have uh, our, let's say, our chemical process. And in this process, we're going to be knowing most of the, uh, let's say, inputs or variables, unit operations, streams. So what we want to do is first try to simulate the status quo or what do we have already in the plant? And then working through the simulation environment, the physical property environment, we want to run the simulation and verify results. So it's very important to get the results. If we were doing this in real life, we will go back and verify real life results with the results of the simulation. And if they are, let's say, engineeringly okay, we will go through the what if scenarios. After that, I prepare a set of case studies in which we're going to be adding uh, little changes on the process. So we want to see what happens. What happens when we change the composition? What happens if we change this temperature? What happens if we change the number of stages in a column? And so on. So they are forming case studies. And that's the main idea. Not only to know how to run processes, but also how to change, how to get, uh, change inputs, how to get the results or the outputs and more importantly, learn how to analyze those processes. And afterwards, you will finish with the course. So it's a very simple course, but I think it's very important, especially if you haven't been working through or with Aspen Plus, this is definitely going to be perfect for you. So guys, once again, I want to congratulate you that you decided to take this course and I'll see you in the next lecture.